Hello hello guys. Uh, so leo nilikuwa napita pita hapa hivi. Ah uh, nimeona wacha nionjeshe wacha Hii ndio place nilianzia maisha when I was still new. <laughs> Sasa hapa hivi hii place inaitwa Park Lane. Anga ukiangalia nyumba ukiangalia hizi style size za zamani. Uh, so nilianzia maisha hapa when I, when I came here in 2017 December kama siko say. Yeah. Hapa hivi nilikuwa <laughs> naishi kwa studio. Studio ni kama bed sitter mtaani, unaona? But the funny thing na hizi building, hizi apartment. Na ndio hii yenye kama mbele. This is a school actually. Hii ni sijini elementary school if I'm not wrong. Yeah, that's an elementary school. So ukiangalia hii area kuna konga na a lot of gunshots. Alafu ukiangalia nyumba zao ni mzee. Apart from nyumba kuwa mzee, unapata maintenance kitu kiaribika kitu kama AC ama heater kiaribika au kuji kutengenezea unaona au kuji kutengenezea that easier kwa sababu ukiangalia pesa zenye wanalipa hapa hivi ni pesa kidogo and another thing na hii na hii na hizi apartment unapata wengi wenye wako hapa hivi wana legal papers sasa inabidi waishi hapa hivi unaona mingi ziko mingi ziko on na meki wa meki ni kama wa Kenya by the way so wa meki kazi yao wanajaribu kuni wanajaribu ku diverse system wenye na waka hapa hivyo wanaenda kufanya vitu mlanga nyuma so unapata vitu zao most as quick correct na hakuna mali unaweza wapele hakuna mali unaweza kuni like kuambia ati wewe kitu haifanyi so nini unaona kwa sababu hata wenyewe pia nakuokolea uh, so hapa hii ndio leasing office if i'm not wrong this is the leasing office yeah ilikuwa ungekuja ungekuja hapa hivi u complain ati sijui hii haifanyi sijui ac haifanyi nobody cares about it kwa siku zote ilikuwa wakati wa winter ukapata uh, snow ikakuwa imepiga tu vizuri na nimetokea job kufika hapo napata ya hit yangu did hit haifanyi kwa nyumba what i did unavaa viatu unavaa majacket <laughs> yeah so uroda the real life stories unaona kwa sababu wanga le building zenyewe unaona ni za zamani kabisa Ah uh, sawa so, Lord liamoe kuja nitembeze rafiki yangu huko hivi. Wewe unaona jezi mapadu bebe zimeka. Kwa pena mali tunakaa sasa hizi. Ah kuna tunakaa hapa bali kwa far. <laughs> By far much much far. Mm. Yeah. Maji nimetoka Wera jioni unafika hapa. Alafu by the watu wengi huku pa clan wanapata wana kazi kwa sababu wanaona legal papers. Kama una legal papers Ah na kama unaweza notice waje nikuonyesha kitu moja. Kiana mali upate hizi mani hizi ma pick up hizi mzee mzee ziko mengi. <laughs> na magari zingine fadi fadi kama hizi. Jua hii area ni ghetto. Unaona? Kwa sababu unapata hizi ma pick up mosi wanazinua. Wanazidio kwa sababu ya kazi hizi kazi za mkono mkono. Mtu anataka kuhama, unawaita, unawagei kama ngiri moja, wanakuhamisha. The funny thing kuna mtu aliniuliza, "Mbona mbona tu uko hata ghetto inakaa vibaya?" Huko the funny thing hii ni country pe yake hata unapata mtu homeless sana nyumba akona gari kwa sababu hapa gari mtu yote almost kila mtu is like ni kama bicycle unaona utahitaji sasa hapo utaona hizo kuna a lot of pickup sasa tukiangalia huko there's a lot of unaona tayo bendera ya bendera ya Mexico utapata wa Mexico na kana hizi magari kubwa kubwa kwa sababu unakonga na large families utakutana uta, hapa na magari funny funny because of maisha unaona naona hii ni wewe una kama usiji kama umeona nyumba kama hii wewe una nyumba kama hii atidi gorofa ni zile style za zamani kabisa so i hope you enjoy kuonaona hapa nilikuwa na kuonyesha by the way i was just passing by nikasema wacha nionyeshe mahali nilianzia maisha so hapa nilianzia maisha but nashukuru mapi nimefika but bado sijafika mapi naelekea ni kwa kufika tufike kwa housing na uh, to buy keja which najua itakuja kufanyika si mbali vile tegetege kwa hii channel taona <laughs> it will be a surprise <laughs> yeah to end of the one day at a time yeah so hapa uh, na wacha niingia hapa naingia Walmart hapa hivi na by the way kuna mtu anataka kuona Walmart na wanango watu wengi wana order vitu mingi Walmart but watu wengi wajua ta Walmart yenyewe na kaje so siku moja nda siku moja nda video hapo so that's it for now we enjoy your video subscribe cheza kama wewe na pia comment section ni wapi muda kuona ni swali gani mko nayo uliza mimi nikapa kujibu na kuwapeleka so and next time this is walmart tumefika walmart hapa hivi yeah
so until next time adios yes bado tuko hizi mitaa zangu mali nilianzia maisha na kama unaangalia let me slow a little bit kama unaangalia hizi bado ni apartment sasa ukiangalia apartment kama hizi zina kwa way cheaper kwa sababu watu hapo unapata maybe kama wanafanya kazi <coughs> they are not be, being paid a lot of money na unapata wengi wa unapata maybe in studio na issue huku ama unapata ni unapata maybe ni ni, ni hao wameki mosi wameki so jo wameki wao na escape wanakuja hapa ni uh, wanakuja wanakuja hapa US indirect so ndafutanga mahali penye at least iko much cheaper unaangalia ukiangalia the whole apartments unaangalia they are not that ni si za bei na ukiangalia za zamani na one challenge is unapata kwa hizo apartment utapata kama uji kuna kunguni hapa hivi hapa America kunguni ziko cockroach ziko utakutana na panya hata ukikaa vibaya utakutana <laughs> yeah utakutana na kila kitu so you better wish mali pazuri na pia ukiangalia kwa hizo apartments kwa apartment kama hizo inakuwa na kitu kitaitwa section 8 section 8 ni nyumba za serikali sasa nyumba za serikali za kusaidia watu kama refugees ama kama huwezi kulipa rent unaona kama wewe ni homeless you can apply for them especially kwa na family lafi ni shule yao this is their school uh, they don't pay anything actually they don't pay anything you can record for me yeah they don't pay anything hapo una, unasoma kidogo yeah na pia playground ni kape you can do uh, you can do game unakuja ku train hapo napiga ma games hapo unaona So this area the whole area is a residential area but ukiangalia ni at least those poor people yeah hapa hivi ndio serikali kusaidie ah ndio pata serikali na manisha wewe ni kwa poor hapa ni mtu mwenye ana earn below 23000 kwa estate you are considered a poor hauzi ukajilisha kwa sababu ukiangalia hapa maisha is way expensive ah so utapata maybe unapata kama student like student legally unaruhusiwa ku work 20 hours a week na that on uh, 20 hours una work uh, only in inside school orona which unapata kama una work 20 hours a week uh, for two is that 40 hours then uh, 80 hours a month that's little hours because legally na for work kama ni mtu wa kawaida vitu zako zimekaa vizuri na for work 40 hours a week unaona which 40 hours a week kama una earn kama 15 dollars utatengeneza kitu kama sotano kuendelea unaona a week with that one kidogo utasurvive but it's a strain so you need a second job but sasa kama kama unasema unalipa unalipa that na ujiwezi maybe uko na mtoto disabled au uko na nini you apply for kitu inaitwa section 8 hapo utasaidia utapata nyumba hautalipia chochote kuna mahali pengine utaambia ulipe stima na maji but kuna mahali pengine totally inakuwa total free you not pay for anything but then ukianza kufanya fanya kazi ama mmoja one of house member anaweza kufanya kazi serikali anaweza kuambia anaweza kulipa so mbili so tatu depending na banya watu sasa unyi wote ukifika mahali mtafala out of status anaweza utakuwa qualify for section 8 itabidi sasa utafute nyumba ya rental sasa hapa draisi mtu kulala ni kujitakia but sasa another thing yenye nafanya watu wengi wanakuwa kwa street na hapa kuna watu kwa street the reason watu wetu wengi wanakuwa kwa street kwa sababu unapata maybe amepata section 8 sasa hapa upo inakuwa kama ni one bedroom inaruhusiwa watu wawili peke yake kama ni two bedroom watu watatu wanne kama three bedroom hiyo hiyo wasa unapata unapata watu kama make you know they have big families unapata mtu maybe hako na two bedroom unapata kuna watoto sita plus mama na yeye watu nane unaona hapo apartment wa kuja kugundua tawa kick out so unapata hizo ndio vitu zinachangia Uh, wanakuwa homeless na baadaye wanakuja na wana enroll for easy section 8. Kitu ya pili ni hao wote wanatoka Tanzania, wanatoka ni not Tanzania, wanatoka Kenya, wanatoka Somalia, wanatoka wapi? Sasa hizi Ukraine kwa sababu hizo vita refugees unaona. Hao kikuja automatically wanaoingizwa wanaingizwa section 8. Na from there sasa people watailegezwa wana, wana ni. Na kama ni refugee utapewa visa, utapatiwa visa na utapatiwa green card but with the restriction au hizo karudi nyumbani mpaka ile siku utapata sisi ship that's when you ka unaweza rudi nyumbani so a uh, hivi video hata nimalizia hapo hivi nishatoka kwa maskini huko siko maskini unaona huko atakuwa makenya <laughs> sida kanyo na mtu hapa tuko hapa sasa tuko kwa maskini <laughs> hapa tuko ijoko na pesa so leo ndio moto unyeshe hizi mitaa venye zinakaa i hope you enjoy hii video 
na umefurahi uh, hapa pia kuna school kuna shule hapa pia naanza ni sije kama ni high school nadhani inakonga high school unaona but uh, yeah iko 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 inside i guess yeah iko inakonga inside yeah so hii video cha tuimalizia hapa tuonane on the next videos na kama uja subscribe please consider subscribing subscribing kwa sababu nataka tupushi channel ifike mbali that's it for now adios